Hi guys, so I'm back home, as you can see. Um, and yeah, the other day I went into town with my friend Maddie and I was in Forever New and noticed that they had hair donuts for six dollars and I've been wanting one of these for ages because normally when I do like top knots, like high bun kind of things, I use like the sock bun method and I find that it's very unreliable, sometimes it works for me, sometimes it doesn't. Um, so I picked one of these up and so I figured I should do a video for you guys on how I do my buns with one of these. Um, so what you'll need, a donut obviously, two hair ties and some bobby pins Ooh. and a hairbrush. So what you want to do is put your hair in a ponytail. So the height of your ponytail will depend on how high you want your bun. I like mine to be quite high. Gosh, my hair's naughty. Um, which is something that I find really difficult. Putting my hair in a, like a high ponytail and having it still be neat. Like, I don't know, I just like it. But, yeah. So, yeah, just decide where you want your bun. So you can have it high, like mid, mid head, I don't know, you know what I mean? Like midway, half half kind of thing. Um, or you could even have it like quite low. But yeah, so you just want to put it in a ponytail like this and make sure it's pretty tight. Not tight enough that your head hurts though. And then you'll get your donut. And you'll put your hair through so you look like that, which is a good look, right? And then all you're gonna do is you're gonna pick your hair up and you wanna lay it out over the donut so it's all covered. Um, this would probably work better if your hair was a little, hello, um, wet. Um, it just might be easier to keep it down. So just, yeah, go around with your fingers and move the hair around until you think it's, you know, good enough. And then you'll get your other hair tie. This is such a good look, isn't it? Your other hair tie. And you'll go like that. So it looks like this. So just, yeah, place it over the top of the bun. Wow. Um, so then you'll have these bits of hair left. So all you'll do is wrap it around the base. Bow him. And... And then you get the other bits of hair and do the same thing. Okay. And pin it in. So then you can go around with your fingers and feel if there's any other flyaway bits from like the bits that you've wrapped around, just pin them down too. And then I have little fluffies. See what I mean? I can't do a high ponytail without there being messy bits. Um, so I'm just get another bow pin. Pin that so it doesn't. Oh, that wasn't a very good pinning job of me, was it? Um, yeah, and then I have little fluffy bits at the end of my hair. These little weird little guys. So, um, I like to pin those up too. So, you just bump in. 
And then yeah, and then you can leave it tight, or you can like pull on it a little, mess it up a little bit. See how you have these little bits that have like come out? You just get a little pin. Then. And basically that's it. How much easier is that than the sock bun method? I'm just saying. Mine's a little bit wonky actually. That's a bit better. Um, yeah, and then just finish off with some hairspray. Mine's just this one. And it's like a travel size. And I don't actually know if there's any in it. Because I just got back from holidays. So I don't know. But... Oh, yeah. Tons. But... Yeah, you would just do this like you normally would and spray it. And then, you know, pat down the little flyaways. And basically, that's how you do it. So it'll end up like that. I'm just gonna, like, so you can see the top of it. Um, so, yeah. So simple, right? So, if you like doing this, and you don't have a hair donut or you use the sock button, please just buy a hair donut. I swear it's so much easier. It like take it's taken me six minutes to do my hair. And that's with me like chatting and like explaining it. If I wasn't explaining it to you guys, then it would take me even less time. So please buy one. I promise you won't regret it. Um so I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you found it really useful. Like I learned how to do it from watching a YouTube video, so... Mm. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye!